my Taurus, this is just with your May 10th to the 31st, 2018 general reading. I hope you guys are having an enjoyable day so far. Taurus, um, yeah, there's going to be a showdown. I don't know if it's already taken place. Uh, it it is a showdown is about to occur. And I feel like it's funny because <laughs> some of you, it looks like it's going to take place in the home. Okay. Uh, it, it, it seems that there is a showdown going on in the home. And if it's not because of a marriage, like it's you're married, if you have other people in your home, it has something to do with control. It has something to do with feeling like as though people are not um, respecting rules and regulations. Others may feel like your rules and regulations or rules and regulations are ridiculous and they, they veer on the side of abuse. And I feel like someone is going to really let it be known. There's like a showdown. Okay. The challenge is going to be coming out of this situation, getting on the other side after certain things are said, okay, against one another. Now, I feel as though, um, be in the chat. And why is that a challenge? Because whoever is communicating with the other, one person, and I get this strongly that it's a feminine energy, you may be dealing with a, a unruly child or um, a grandchild or a mate that acts like a child, but I get male and female energy very clearly. The female energy is going to be very calm, cool, and collected simply because she feels like she runs the roost. And the male energy, again, may be very combative, argumentative to a fault to some extent. And I feel that there may be someone calling the other person out about being less than honest about a situation, okay, when they come back in the home, okay, which is going to create some form of, like I said, a showdown. Your home, as it was, will be some form of upset, okay? And I feel like it's this on again, off again, like you, you argue, you fuss, you fight with one another, then someone is trying to amend it and, and, and apologize where the other person is like, no, uh, no, I'm done. I'm No, they may just work and that's it. That's all. <laughs> you may see them come home from work and that's it. And they bury themselves in work. And other than that, they don't want to eat if you give them food. They don't want to talk when you're ready to kind of settle things. So there's that. I feel like whoever is the person that is feeling um, as though they are not, um, that they're confronting you. They're the combative ones. Whoever is the combative one, like they had to come and confront you. They feel as though you have manipulated a situation or are there some point, and it doesn't mean it's you. You could be the one that feels this way. So whoever's a combative one that had to, you know, forcefully address it, there's that feeling of, of, of um, feeling manipulated, feeling like they're overtly controlled to some extent. And Taurus says, I feel you guys are the one that is laying down the law. But this is about to turn. I feel like it's about to turn. And this other person, to some extent, may be asserting themselves. So someone in the home is going to be asserting themselves with Taurus, okay? Um, and I feel like it's going to create some form of a divide. Uh, now, this can be in other aspects of your life. You may hear about this. It could be happening in the family environment with your family. So you may hear that a brother, a sister's husband, some situation going on outside of, of your home. So it could be, again, family or friends or even a neighbor. Like It's like, you know, it's a lot of ruckus going on with my neighbors next door. But there's a lot of shakeups that are about to occur in a home situation, okay? Uh, and I feel that there's going to be the, the advice here is that you have to understand that both of you are right. Whatever the conflict is coming from, you're both right. And at the end of the day, it's two people that are starting to kind of have a V formation. So you're starting to part ways. You're starting to go in two different directions completely. And I feel because one person is starting to liberate themselves. And this could very well be the case of like a teenage child where the, the teenage child is just being unruly and and they're at that age where they're 18, they're about to turn 18, 19. It's like, I don't have to be here anymore. I'm going to leave that sort of thing. Uh, but I do get this divide in the home. So that will be an issue and that will be the, a general theme. And again, if it's not in your particular home and you live alone, this will be something that may come to your door, like call on the phone or someone comes to your house and say, hey, I have to live with you. Can I come stay with you? We're breaking up. Um, I can't take that anymore. Can I come and stay with you? So I do feel like home life will be 
some form of the, a, a huge theme for the month of May. And happy birthday to you Tauruses out there, you uh, late Aries and Mayborn Tauruses. Happy birthday, guys. Uh, but yeah, that's the theme for you guys. And I do see by the second week of May, there may be some apologies coming your way. So at first, it's a it's a clear theme of conflict, drama, someone standing their dr- ground, the other person, one person at first is coming to the person and trying to resolve it, which they're being met with absolutely no response. Um, and then, you know, underneath the surface, you have both parties. And I get very clearly the male energy who's thinking about leaving. The male energy is planning to leave. They're leaving, they're leaving, they're leaving. And I feel the feminine energy is at this time kind of fine with it. They're kind of fine with this situation if you're leaving or not. If you're going to leave, you're going to leave. If you're not, you're not. They've tried. So some of you may feel like I've tried, I've tried. This person is going to leave. The second week, or excuse me, the last week of May, it reverses again. So I see someone trying to make amends. Now, if it's not that person that you had the fallout with in the home place, you may be trying to call someone and say, hey, you guys need to work things out. Or someone could be calling you saying, you know, why don't you give a person a second chance, let them back in, or they want to apologize, that sort of thing. So I get a lot of apologies uh, coming both ways, Okay with this situation okay uh so yeah a rumble in in the home life seems to be the biggest theme going on for you guys i do see success though um individually independent to each person each one of you whoever's in this home life situation um it's a choice you don't have to stay together you you know your kid doesn't have to stay with you uh this person doesn't have to stay in your home so it's just a choice of do you guys still want to remain under the same roof now i know some people say well this is very specific but let the month continue you'll find if you have other people living in your home that that's going to be the theme of a leaving a moving uh, a disruption some type of chaos and unsettled issues will erupt in the home for the remainder of may so that's what i have for you guys for this general um trying to look and see if there's anything else um i will be putting out other aspects of um videos for you guys so this is really the, the general theme i do see feminine energy being very assertive verbally clear ex- expressing exactly what you mean and how you feel about things and having no qualms what the outcomes are they're fine with a situation severing uh you're very confident with you in, in yourself Taurus women and i feel like um it's only going to grow <laughs> uranus is about to come right in mere days so there you go. Some of you are even ushering this. You may even be manipulating it, Taurus women, to some extent to force someone's hand to kind of make a move because you kind of are ready to kind of have your own space to do the things that you want to do. Taurus women are really a force to be reckoned with at this time to some extent. And I feel like the men are kind of holding on by a thread. Uh, the male energy of, of Taurus men may be fighting uh, with the energies, the counterparts that they have. Um so that's what I have for you guys for your general energy. Uh, please, if you would like to share with us how this re- re- resonates, please do so in the comment section below. We'd love to hear from you. If you would like something personal with me, I can be reaching the beginning and end to this video. And if you are new to this channel, welcome and subscribe because I will be back very soon with another one. Take care, Taurus.